program started just a few months ago here in Metro Detroit. And while well, Oliver here, come on, buddy, is obviously a real dog. Experts are saying the benefits of the robotic pets are proving to be just as real. My stuff doggy. <laughs> He does things. Evelina Standifer received an Ageless Innovations Joy for All companion pet in November. Originally designed as a consumer product to inspire play, the pandemic revealed an even more powerful use. Hello there. A way to slow or reverse dementia disorders, which are proven to progress more rapidly in isolation. Well, I was a little skeptical at first, but the feedback we've gotten has just been so positive. I mean, this has been a life changing experience for some folks. Dr. Thomas Jankowski is a research gerontologist at Wayne State University. He says social isolating to protect loved ones from COVID-19 has amplified another serious health risk. Severe loneliness uh, can affect your physical health as much as smoking or obesity does. The lonelier you are, the sicker you get. And a study done in 2020 shows that one quarter of those over 65 are considered socially isolated and 50% of those are more likely to develop dementia, 30% are more likely to have heart disease or a stroke. But in the midst of a pandemic... How do you help people when you can't have contact with them? The Senior Alliance launched hotlines and Zoom programs, but it wasn't enough. We were taking a look at all the resources that were available to older adults um, when it came to isolation during the pandemic. Program manager Andrew Dabrowski acquired 30 companion robot pets back in the fall just to see. Are they making the impact? And I would say just based on anecdotal feedback at this point, um, it's been overwhelmingly positive. What's he saying? What? <laughs> I'd flip if he told me he loved me. <laughs> the robotic dog is reactive to Evelyn's touch and her voice, moving its eyes, wagging its tails, and turning its head. Does he keep you company? Yeah, he keeps me company at night. In about a dozen small studies done across the country, these companion pets have consistently reduced depression and anxiety, slowed cognitive decline, and increased cognitive capability. In one anecdotal case, a patient spoke for the first time in years to her doggy. It's helping to prevent people from uh, having to deal with worse physical problems, having to see their doctor more often, having to make a trip to the hospital. I think it's a security and the fact that um, he does move probably gives that sense of friendship and companionship when she's alone in her room. They want to give away hundreds more of these robotic companion pets, so we've got links to resources on our website at WXYZ.com. I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson, 7 Action News. Wow.